What is up folks, this is Shady Tech. In this video, I'm going to do charging time test on POCO X3 versus a Samsung Note 20 Ultra. First of all, bear in mind that both of them have a different charging watt. POCO X3 has 33 watt, whereas Note 20 Ultra has 25 watt. And also the battery is kind of different. X3 has 5120 milliamp versus 4500 mAh on uh, Note 20 Ultra. But anyway, let's see how much difference they can make from 0 all the way to 100%. Right, for the first 30 minutes, you can see that POCO X3 just at the head by 4% at 40%, whereas Note 20 Ultra is at 36%. You don't see much of a difference here. And now, right to the 35 minutes mark, I started to turn on the phone and let's see how much difference it makes. And from this point on, you can see that POCO X3 is at 63, Note 20 Ultra is at 60. Still not much different here, just about 3% difference. After 50 minutes, you can see that POCO X3 leading by quite a bit, leading ahead by quite a bit at 74% and Note 20 Ultra is at 64%, about 10% difference here. But from here on, it gets a little bit interesting because at about 1 hour and 20 minutes marks, POCO S3 is about 99% and Note 20 Ultra is at 92%. You expect that X3 should be at 100% any couple of seconds now, but it's not. At 99%, POCO S3 appears to be still charging for about 9 more minutes before it hit 100%. And it only hit 100% at about an hour and 26 minute marks. Whereas not 20 ultra at this point is about 95% marks already. And not long after that, about 1 hour and 34 minutes, not 20 ultra hit 100%. So you can see that even though Poco X3 has 33 watt versus not 20 ultra 25 watt, you won't see much difference between the, the charging speed of both of them. Only about 8 minutes difference actually. Okay, so that's my conclusion for this test. This test is just showing guys how much the difference can make. So uh, no hate here guys. And this is Shady Tech. Until the next video, see you soon.